Vader hastily charts a path for Exegol, and is immediately met by an eldritch space monster. Ochi sees the writing on the wall and begs Vader to take a detour. Vader doesn't relent. They no longer had that option for a detour, as the Umbaran unleashes a fleet of TIE fighters. They had to lead him straight to the beast tentacles. The odds were so against Vader that he gave in and actually agreed with Ochi. This plan would lead to certain death. In his strategic retreat, Vader took out 11 TIE fighters. So, they just unleashed every TIE fighter they had. There was only one route to flee, straight to the beast. The Summa Verminoth the galaxy's greatest predator. This specific breed evolved to hunt its own kind. Its attacks transcended the physical. If it fails to crush Vader's body, surely it would break his mind. As a red smoke invades the duo's senses, Vader relives his duel with Obi-Wan, his duel with his son, the death of what remained of Anakin Skywalker at the hands of Obi-Wan. He had a vision of Luke telling Anakin that he loved him, but there would be no escape. He pleads with Luke. He can destroy the Emperor. It is his destiny, but his cries fall on deaf ears as his son drives his saber through his heart. The last thing he sees is his son Luke joining the Emperor.